Hey there, Rodrigo here for Textualize and in this short video I want to show you how you can use a screen callback to handle the return value of a screen. So we're going to be creating a modal screen and we want to use a value return from that modal screen to determine whether we should exit our application or not. So the application I have on me right now from a previous video has a modal screen that shows up when I press M and it just shows yes or no and two buttons and I want to and I want that pressing these buttons determines whether I exit the application or not. And I want to do this by returning the selected value to the user. So how do I do this? I'll start by importing the textual on decorator to handle button presses here. So on button.pressed I'll want to leave the modal screen but what I'll want to do first is I'll want to look at the event button and check its ID and see if it matches yes so let's see that let's say that this button has the ID yes and this button has the ID no so if the ID of the button sorry so if the ID of the button is yes then I want to dismiss this screen with the boolean value true and if it's not I want to dismiss with the boolean value false but maybe I should actually just do this so, so when the user presses a button I want to dismiss the screen and I want to pass this expression as the return value which will be either true or false depending on whether the user pressed yes or no and now what I'll do is I'll change my application to handle this return value. And how can I do that? Well, when I push my screen, there's a callback that you can pass in. And this callback will be called when you dismiss the screen. And the callback will receive as argument, as its argument, the value that you pass in. So, so let's say that the callback will be exit app or yeah, sure. So, not exit app, but maybe exit app, because we don't know yet if we will actually exit the app or not. So maybe exit app, and we receive a boolean value, and if the boolean is true, then we do self.exit, for example. And so now if I run my application, I press M, I press no, the modal screen goes away, but we're still in the application. If I press M again, and if I press yes, then we exit the application. So you can see that this callback mechanism is the simplest way to use values from the modal screen. And obviously I could have just exited the app from within here. I didn't need to pass the information back to the application. But I don't always want to do that, right? So if this was a more general yes or no modal screen to ask an arbitrary yes or no question, then I will want the answer in my application and not necessarily inside the modal screen so this modal sorry this callback system is how you you make information flow from the modal screen back to the application now in a future video i'll show you how you can pass information to the modal screen when you're creating it so that you could customize for example the question that gets asked but that's in a future video so this was what i wanted to show you for this video if you have any questions feel free to ask in the comments below or in our discord server i'll leave links links for that and the documentation below and i'll see you in the next one bye